I have been very blessed with the critic and I've been frustrated with them also, but it's okay. Yeah. I, I have been in New York cooking now for, let's say, 35 years, and I've seen 10 critic at the New York Times, 10 food critic, and I'm still standing. <laughs> of cooking has expanded so much. I mean, 50 years ago in New York City, uh, restaurants were pretty standardized. Great French restaurants, menu were not so different from each other. So recipe was a secret, like uh, they will not share a certain technique or certain preparation. And uh, today, I think we have to be able to share everything to continue to teach, but continue to create and continue to be different maybe than other. And so I think today you, think you can take 10 of the best restaurants in New York. They are very different. I want to ask you about noise in a restaurant. It's sometimes so hard over the music, over the noise, over the boisterous atmosphere to have a conversation. Noise in the restaurant? Uh, it's a positive thing, but it can be a negative thing. Why is it positive? Well, because the, des the restaurant is doing well. Yeah. If there is no noise, there is no customer. <laughs> I, I love a lively restaurant. It's just a question of spacing and comfort. If you're in a bistro and the table are a little tighter together and you happen to be between a table of six and a table of four and you have just two people, it becomes annoying. It's very difficult. So we try to be, we, we try to have a little psychology of care. What do you do about critics? I have been very blessed with the critic and I've been frustrated with them also, but it's okay. Yeah. I, I have been in New York cooking now for, let's say, 35 years and I've seen 10 critic at the New York Times, 10 food critic. And I'm still standing and I'm still <laughs> passionate about what I do and I'm still teaching other about the craft. What about uh, chefs that leave you and open their own restaurants? I have trained countless uh, young chefs and some of them leave and some of them I invest with them and I say, okay, I want, I want to invest with you because I, I love you, I like you and I understand you, you gave a good time of your life with me and now it's time for you to do your own and I trust them as well. My question has to do with the future and you have this big restaurant opening up in one Vanderbilt. It's gonna be beautiful. It's gonna be special, and I think it gives me an opportunity to show another facet of myself and to be able to place a great team there as well and to work in collaboration with them and, and to create something very different than the other. Mm -hmm.